What the? The menu! It's off-centered! It should be right in the middle, yeah, where I am! Oh no! I don't know what to do! The camera can't move over anymore! Eee! Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. Don't go in the menu over here, it's too scary. Way too scary. So in the last part, we've gotta... Well, we played the chorus, but... We've gotta make them some cocoa. We found out... We need the ingredients... Well, the co ingredients for cocoa are all inside, yes. For these guys that are chilly over here... And they're like, warmth! We need the warmth! And we also got three cups ahead of time. That were just hanging out around the floor. Just just because one was like over here, other was over there, or something like that, another was on the chair, and anyway, I guess we can go inside now that we got the key from his pocket as well. So where do we start? I guess we should start at the fridge, huh? For some milk. Plenty of milk in here. Yep, yep, yep. Yep, yep, yep. No cups in here. I already got three cups. The one in kitchen appliance I've got some proficiency with. <laughs> the microwave. <laughs> so wait, hold on a sec. Are we gonna have great difficulties making cocoa or something? Really can't be trusted with one of these. I found the cocoa. Okay, let's just add a little cocoa to this cup. Cocoa in progress. So does that mean it's like added to the cups that are in my inventory now? Oh wait, so I just need more. So I need that for all three of them, right? I assume? Oops. Okay, found the cocoa powder, but I have nary a thing to put it in. Okay, so I was right. I gotta put it in all the cups of cocoa. So now the cups have been transformed into cocoa in progress. And I assume the milk is next. Cold cocoa. Add the milk. So I guess we're gonna use the microwave probably instead of the, st the stove to heat it up. Because this is it's the only thing he is proficient with. Alright. We basically got a cup of chocolate milk. And let's see what you have. Plenty of milk in here. Okay, I thought there might be more dialogue for that. Wait, I just want to see if he's going to attempt to use the stove. I could warm the cocoa on you if I knew how to work it, but I don't. So I think I'll keep away. Okay. <laughs> no cups in here. And so is, is there anything else to find around here? Just, just before I get into the finishing touches here at the microwave. Can I pull out the flour or something? Can I inspect the cocoa from this side? I can, but no. Okay. Alright, time to warm the cocoa up. You know, that coloration of the cocoa container over there looks a lot like the Swiss Miss. I bet that's a slight reference to it. Alright, here we go! Do 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 do! And now we wait. Yes, stare into the light. Absorb the radiation with your own body! Hot cocoa. Do I have to use this three times though? Yep, yeah, that is what I thought. So we're using it two more times. We're absorbing all the radiant energy from the microwave as much as we possibly can just because rather than heating them all up at the same time, I guess all three cups just don't fit in there for some reason. It just seemed like everything had to be done, done individually here for some reason. I don't know. I don't know, but it looks like... We've got everything. Wait, actually, hold on. One kitchen appliance, same dialogue, okay. So I guess I'll pop all through there. Wait, hold on, hold on, I just realized something. Did you see the way that that door led me through there? How does that even work? Go through here. So is this building, like, oblong on the outside or something like that? Because this is obviously not matching up with the out with the same room dimensions. Nope, that is definitely not oblong on the outside. Because, <laughs> yeah, if if you were to put this room and attach it to this room by flipping it upside down using the door, it would be way off to the right side and upper right side of the area. Mysterious. Mysterious. How does that house work? Anyway, I got the cocoa. Okay, so I guess I gotta give them to him individually. Alright, here, drink this. You'll ma you'll make it. Oi, oh, I didn't ask to be saved, mate. Get out of your mental state of withdrawn stuff. Sorry, which you seem a bit cold. <laughs> Not cold. Okay, I believe you. You weren't cold. No more cocoa for you, then. Feeling warmer now? Mate, that was a cold. Alright, you. Warmth. I want to put my face in the fire. Please bring warmth. Here, drink this. Thank you. You look warmer now. It may appear that way, but I'm not. The cold in this place cuts right to the core. 
I only came here to visit my brother. And it turns out he's a snow, ba snow bandit and was inviting me to their hideout. I guess it kind of drifted apart on the morality spectrum. <laughs> I guess. I wonder if maybe this is a snow bandit here and we will be battling against Team Rocket at some point. I don't know. Cuckoo! Go, 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 here you are. Thank you so much. Did you, did you heat this in the microwave? I can't have this. It's got to be stove heating. Yes. Oh. It's not going to taste as good. Do you have any other cocoa? This isn't the time to be picky. You're not going to make it. You're going to freeze over. You're, you're, you're right. Just I'll just I'll make myself a real one once I get inside. Just defrost me. Thanks. I just poured it over my head. It'll work just fine. I feel a lot better. Now everyone run inside, but somehow worse. <laughs> just did not like that microwaved cocoa. I <laughs> just could not stand it whatsoever. Everybody is safe now. Don't let me keep you any longer. I actually came here looking for an old book. Cathane's golf trad. An old golf book? Can you describe it? I bet he knows of this book. It's old. I bet I'll know it just by that description. There's nothing else like it. It's incredibly valuable. Incredibly valuable! Uh, uh, sorry. Never heard of it. Yes, you have, didn't you? Oh, and I just noticed that the camera is now perked out to the right side now that we gave them the cocoa. See that? Because now we can see green off to that side. Or maybe that's rough. I don't know. One of the others might know something. But, well, they're even worse off than the first slot. Oh, jeez. We can actually have to make it on the stove this time to actually warm them up. Oh, they're totally frozen over. We can get fireballs and hit them with it. Like hit balls through the fire or hit coals out of the fire into them. Ooh. Oh my. Do you think they're going to make it? I don't know. Goodness. We're going to need a lot of cocoa. <laughs> they might be beyond cocoa at this point. These people have gone into a deep freeze. Shouldn't have skipped their frost resistance training. <laughs> it may still be possible to save them. We used to have special golf ball for breaking deep freeze, but the snow bandits ended up stealing all of them. Okay, so we gotta battle the snow bandits with golf balls first, probably in a match of golf. Now we just use driving range seconds. <laughs> if you're really serious, maybe you could track down their camp. If you manage to find out where it is, I'll let you take my snowmobile there. Oh no! We're going to crash into everything. I get to ride the snowmobile? <laughs> the specific ball we need is rare, and it's hard to tell it apart from the others. So bring me 900 balls with your base. Oh, one of them is bound to be the right one. <laughs> right. Let's get ourselves 900 balls. I hope we don't have to pick them all up individually, like making each the cups of cocoa individually. <laughs> Oh, I guess they should look around then, find their base. Feeling warmer now? <laughs> it's hot <it's> cold. <gasps> what about the two that we saved from the cold? Maybe they're at the... Okay, here's one of them. How's it going? Warmer yet? Somewhat. But I think I'll keep myself confined to the indoors as much as possible. Don't want to get cold again. Have you been to visit your brother at the bandit camp? No, I don't think I will. I don't have the heart. Can you tell me how to get there? Okay. So, it's like this. Mm hmm. Hmm. We, we're gonna need like a map or something. Okay, those directions should see you through to the hideout. Oh, so we're gonna use the snowmobile and go to that waste area. I betcha. Make sure to report your findings back to me, and do be careful with the snowmobile. <laughs> oh, we're gonna totally destroy it, of course. Oh wait, wait. Oh, no, I wanted to talk to the other person, which is probably. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I wanted to talk to the other person, which is probably in the kitchen making the cocoa. I didn't know this was going to start up. Can I go back to the other area first? It appears that I can. Is this correct? <laughs> uh, yes. Oh, no! This person. <laughs> I guess we gotta get some balls of fire. Pro we're probably going to light this stuff with the spark. Oh, wait, wait, hold on, really? Can we light it with this? I never tried that. Oh, I see. Oh, ah, nice. We can warm our bodies in this. Ah, so comfy. Can't even tell skin is burning. It's too cold outside. Skin was too cold to even ignite or melt. Ah, ah. Well, I presume 
Let's just try it for kicks here. If I take my zipper and hit... Okay, I'll just do it like that. If I hit a ball into it just for the fun of it, I don't know if this will actually work. It will not. Okay. So I guess I will have to save her later. But anyway, I wanted to get that other person's opinion on the Coco back over in the kitchen area. No, 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 I'm stuck. Okay, there we go. How's it going? Did you make your favorite Coco? My taste buds are still recovering for the Coco you forced on me. Next time, I think I will freeze over. I prefer death over your Coco. <laughs> Just that bad. All right. So, I wonder if I should go straight to the hideout or if I should look around here. Because I was starting to look around here. I, I, I thought I was going to start looking around here to look for the bandit base, but, uh, well, well, we found the bandit base because we got directions. And that person, didn't, that lady, didn't even have uh, a dot dot dots above her head or anything like that. So, there's someone to unfreeze over there. That's going to be important, of course. Got to save. Everyone? What the heck? The ice is quite high here. Uh, really? Can, can I hit a ball in there? Like, is this for a special side quest thing? Uh, should I even bother trying to hit a ball? Or is it going to be like that driving range hole that you can't hit into? Or is this covering the hole? I can't really tell. I'm going to just... I'll try it anyway. Let's <laughs> see how things go. Oh no! Oh, oh. No, the ice just rejects it. Okay, so yeah, there's definitely, definitely. Oh, oh you're the guy from. I was gonna say it's, there's definitely, definitely no way I can go over this now. That's why I couldn't walk up close to it. So I'm guessing I'll be able to hit a ball into that hole when I melt that. When I'm able to melt stuff around here. Good to see you haven't froze over. It's a wee bit cold, Nate. Just a wee bit. <laughs> My, aunt, my anvil couldn't they withstand the heat. Could you mind lighting up for me? Uh, looks like everything is leading me over to the bandit camp, so I don't think I should bother with this over here right now. But I could just wander around. Wait, is there any, any ice physics? No? Okay. Just curious. Uh, and pretty indeed. So I bet we're going to have to melt all the stuff by hitting flaming balls. Well, one ball out of the 900 that may or may not be the right ball, I don't know. I don't know. Wait, hold on, hold on, I just noticed something. The snowmen. I bet I could hit a ball into them and get something out of them. I betcha, I betcha. Or not. <laughs> well, maybe I have to melt them later too. Oh, I can't even get through them. I literally have to go all the way around there and go to the bandit cap to the sleeve. So never mind. Alright, so I guess we're not gonna break the snowmobile, but we will absolutely have to use it to go over to the next area, because otherwise we're stuck. We cannot do any quests. So, since I did a lot of dialogue in this part for the most part. Oh no, it's a stealth mission, isn't it? <laughs> On second thought, walking through a snowy wasteland seems a poor decision. I don't know, you could use the snowmobile. So it looks... Is this really a stealth thing? Oh, it really is a stealth thing, isn't it? Hey! Yup, it is! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> well, I can get into here, I guess. I guess I need keys to get through some of this stuff. They can go straight through it, though. So this... Obviously, we're, uh playing Pac-Man here, but it's also partly stealth. Or maybe it's not stealth, or maybe it's just like avoiding the ghosts. <laughs> I thought it was stealth, but it's really more like Pac-Man. I see, I see. So this is so we are technically collecting all the balls individually, but we are but we are collecting them at a absurdly fast rate. <laughs> Uh, I don't even know if I... I should... I'm just doing like, I don't know, perimeter first or something. What is... what the... Hello? <laughs> Bandit key, okay. So that's for the gates, I guess. <laughs> just <laughs> picking up everything, literally. How is he holding all these balls? I don't know. Should not question the game logic, though. Okay, so that was definitely a path I... It was a good idea to take first. So if I got the bandit key, does that mean I can not... Wait a second. Does that mean I can now open all the gates or just one gate at a time? I don't know. But wait, where was that other lower gate place thing? 
And uh, wait, what if I get caught now that I got? Hey. Hmm. I just want to see my gear here. Oops. I mean my items here. Excuse me. 280 balls. Okay. So, so I got a key. Okay. So now I can open the gates. But yeah, that other gate was the thing that I thought I was supposed to open. Cause I. Uh, because I, I, you know, I was near the path that I took to get there. Because it's like a secret path. I think I found the secret path first, actually. <laughs> okay, so I need more keys, I guess. Alright, so let's waka waka waka, get some keys, get some golf balls. <laughs> this is brilliant. <laughs> I, I sort of thought, like, it may have been Pac-Man seeing the, the, the dots, the way that they were formed like that, um, but I, I wasn't sure if it was really like that, like, I wasn't sure if these are actually balls, or if they were gonna be, like, projectiles that they were gonna throw at us, or something like that, but no, nope, it literally is Pac-Man. <laughs> oh, this game. You never know what the poop you are getting into before you get into the poop. Uh, okay, I was through there. Cause I got, got the balls from there. Okay, so I guess, I'm guessing that all the, yeah, I was gonna say all the treasure chests that we're gonna find are gonna contain keys, but I could be wrong though. Could be, uh, I should actually see if I can find my way to that other spot. Actually, no, there's a lot more lock gates. And, uh, well, actually, no, maybe there is, maybe I just haven't seen all the areas that, oh, but I'm gonna get all the balls. I assure you, I'm gonna get all the balls. It's probably exactly 900 balls here or something like that. <laughs> this is like a puzzle slash a maze area more than anything. It just don't touch the quote unquote ghost bandits. <laughs> just go ahead and just take these. I'm a lot faster than they are. Yeah, they're not really all that hard to avoid or anything like that. I just thought it was a stealth mission at first based on their... Uh, it, it just it just reminded me of something that would be like like in a RPG slash Zelda game at an overhead yeah it just yeah that's why I got the idea it was you get what I'm saying here I don't know why I keep on that now <laughs> all right let's go ahead over here did I drop a ball and put it here no I can't I'm, I'm in action mode I cannot put any balls while in action mode did I get them all here it's kind of I'm kind of worried that I'm going to miss some because of the snowflakes in the air and like confusing them with other stuff or something. Yeah, I got to get in and out before he gets... Oh, wait, wait, what? what the... No, 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 what? You can see through the wall? You're not allowed to... I guess your circle was larger than the others, but... Oh. Oh. <laughs> I guess your circle was larger than the others, but still. But still. I was, I was a little thrown for a loop there because I'm used to only having issues when I touch someone. Well, I not get open this, so I guess I can go down that way. Ready? Wait, where am I? Where am I? I wait. Okay, <laughs> I kind of lost my, lost my way there. Okay. Uh, I still need to go back through. The, oh, no, shoot! 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 I still need to go back through this route here to get these. So I might as well, as long as I have to go back through here. Oh, I guess they're sort of following me in a way. Or maybe not, I don't know. Are they, or are they just going through a set pattern? No, it is a set pattern. Okay, so they aren't following me, I just kinda... kinda went into their domain. And got myself caught and thrown out. So, well, I guess technically that this is sort of stealth. Wait, wait, hold on a sec, this is outside the maze, right? Yeah. Another panda key. Of course. Uh, what's in here? What's the password? I don't know. Golf? No. Albatross? No. Coach? Stop trying to guess the password. <laughs> well, I was definitely supposed to come here for balls and the key at the very least, so I guess I'll get the password. Maybe, perhaps from uh, her brother? If we, ever, if we ever should meet him? I don't know if he will here around these parts here. Guess, guess we'll see as we go. Anyway, I gotta get back on track to where I was before. Yeah, so his circle's pretty, pretty large there, so I guess it does indeed go right through the walls. Threw me for a loop. Fell for that beginner's trap. Oh, oh, oh! This is the, yeah, this is the place with the other keys. Okay. How many balls do I have, anyway? I know, I mean, I know I have two. Oh, I got over 900, but I still want to get them all. I'm just, yeah, I guess you don't really have to get them all like I thought, but I still... 
I still feel the need to get them all, just because. Some, something may happen if I get them all. <laughs> uh, I'm scared of your patterns, because I don't know if I'll be sh shunned back to the beginning. I'm pretty far into this at this point, so I kind of want to. I kind of don't want to be pooped back to the beginning if I can help it now. Uh, okay, unless I want to warp back there, like on purpose. Ooh, 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 okay, we're good. We're good. I think. Go through here. Okay, that's how you get to this gate then. Yeah. Alrighty. So I just gotta. How many more? How many more gates? Two more keys for two more gates, I guess. Maybe. Might be. Um, let's go through here. Mm, Gizzy, yeah, that was the that was the gated area from before. Okay, so I still gotta go to, go to that gate. Uh, how are we gonna avoid that guy? If I can go like in some corner that I can avoid him in, or something. Let's watch this pattern and see. Okay, so he doesn't go in that little alcove that is. Ooh, but so he doesn't go in that little alcove that's like L-shaped up over here. Well, it's actually J-shaped if we're talking Tetris pieces, but I mean. <laughs> Oh, yes, yes. Okay, so there we go. So I guess he won't come along and bother me if I'm in here. If they don't follow me or sniff me out or something, okay. So then there's that other gate on the other side, which I still have not figured out how to open. I'm lost again. Oh, geez, oh, geez, where am I? Wait, okay. <laughs> Just that, that transition is a little confusing for me. I don't know. Okay, so... Oh, boy. Where's that? Where's the other gate that i seen? Uh... Hmm. 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 <laughs> eh? Now that's outside the maze. Wait, actually, you know what? Put me back to the beginning. Because <laughs> it may have been near the beginning and I was just running around the areas. Okay, yeah, it was near the beginning. I was just running around areas that I was already through. So it was in the secret path. Yeah. Is that it? Is that all the balls that I can collect? 1,161 balls! I think I've got them all! This is more than enough, I think. <laughs> I mean, you said 900, but... Still. But still. I just don't... I think I got every single one, so I just... I guess I am done with this. Unless it comes to an even 2,000 or something like that, and I miss the secret path or something like... To another green with a huge bucket of balls or something to fill out the rest of it. I don't know. I don't know. So I guess... We're maybe done here? Let's see. Uh, other than getting the password, which we don't have, but... Or maybe the guy that we're gonna give the balls to is gonna get, know the password. I don't know. Alright, so one of these nut balls... we got over 900... <clears throat> balls. Wow! You actually did it. Pro Shop will be stocked for months. Oh, I see. So it wasn't just about getting a single flaming ball. You wanted a... A whole ball for or you wanna get get a whole ball a bunch of balls back for ya. I better sort through them. There you go. There were a few in there. Fireball. Literally. Looks like a regular ball. Yes, but it holds heat like nothing else. Douse it with fire and you'll be able to release people from deep freeze. Maybe one of them will know about that book thing. Or maybe not, that's fine too. Okay, so it looks like I appreciate if you could unfreeze the others too. So it looks like we have done all we could do. For this part, because it's kind of, yeah. <laughs> okay, no, I mean not. I, I mean, I know I could still unfreeze people and stuff like that, but I mean, we have done the clearing out of the quest that we were aiming to do, basically. <laughs> so with that, I'm going to end out the part here. I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you in the next part when I unfreeze the peeps around the area, and probably that hole, and maybe melt the snowmen because they're moving. You know, basically anything that looks like I could ignite... I'm gonna hit a fireball at, just because. <laughs>